What's up, people? It's me, Ken here. I'm actually going to show off my alarm clock. I'm not actually going to show it all completely. Because I got an alarm set on here that I do not want to re uh, to reset. So I'm just going to show off the button layout. It's on the right. On the, uh, when it's all the way at the bottom. Or the hour. Uh, the hourly announcement is on. I'll push it up. Hourly announcement off. Hourly announcement off. If I push it up one more time. The alarm will go up at 7 a.m. It's on alarm mode and the alarm is going to go off. At whatever time I set it for. On the top is the... The time is now 10.53 p.m. Time, uh, the talk button, which is what a lot of people call it. There are two buttons on the back here. Uh, one is uh, the menu button. It's on the right. And, uh, you have to hold it in to set, uh, to actually do the settings. Uh, on the, uh, to the left of that is volume. The two settings, high, low. And on the back below that is the speaker. On the bottom, or where's the battery compartment? Very easy to remove, I, I have to say that. Also on the front, or uh, well, is the uh, arrows take you through the time and date. Uh, I believe that's it. On the front is a round display. You know what? I'll, I'll just do this real quick. Setting gear. Setting time. Setting complete. I'll just Today, do that Friday, May 12th, year 2023. The time is now 10.55 p.m. I only wanted to do that real quick. Yes, you have to hold it in to get uh, the thing set up. Not that big. Takes up very little space. It's an atomic clock so if you just press the button once that that uh you know that you hold down to go into settings with if you just press it once it'll search for the uh the current current time using the uh the signal that it gets so yeah i just wanted to kind of go over that real quick so yeah that's one of those guys uh this is ken i'm signing off for the night